in this tutorial I'm going to help you fix the hardware test that you could do on your Mac and generally it stopped working if you reformatted your hard drive and reinstall the operating system or if you replace your hard drive so in this tutorial you're going to need a working Mac and a USB drive so the first thing is go ahead and plug in the USB drive to your computer go to search and search for disk utility in this utility you want to select your external drive and you want to erase it give it a simple name because we're going to use that name and then make sure you select the OS extended journal once you erase it go ahead and close out of it next step is to go to the top left go to about this Mac go to system report and under model identifier make sure you copy this right here now this tutorial works on older Macs so if you have a newer Mac this process may not work so once you know this model here what you're gonna do is you're gonna go to my description or go to this link here that you see and you're gonna search for your Mac model mine is 11 2 so I'm gonna download this specific file and this is basically to make your USB hard drive bootable and then to be able to load the hardware test. So once you have this file here, what you want to do is you want to open the file. And if you go to Finder, what's going to happen is it's going to mount this, file, this um, disk here. And you need to know that name. So what we're going to do is on the website, there is a command you need to type. So we're going to go to terminal. So search for terminal next. And we're going to copy this command here, but we're going to modify it. All right. So right up to where it says system, the AHT you want to put in in here whatever you see here so I gotta add the E1 so I'm just gonna add E1 and then my USB drive is called USB so I'm gonna modify here to USB once you have that go ahead and press enter alright from here what you're gonna do now is you are going to copy this next command here. And what we're going to do is we're going to paste it and we're going to do the same thing. So I'm going to go ahead and delete USB stick. Mine is called USB, so I'm going to delete that. And here it should also be just USB. All right, once you fix your volume name, go ahead and just go to the end here and press enter and put in your computer password. And you should get another prompt like that, meaning that your USB is ready to go. So basically you met, you made your USB a bootable drive. All right, in the next video, I'm gonna show you what you need to do next so stay tuned while I go ahead and reboot the computer All right. when you restart your computer go ahead and hold the option key while it restarts and keep pressing the option key once the option key is held you're gonna get this menu here and what you're gonna do is you're gonna move to the right and select the EFI partition and go ahead and press enter All right, and with this, your Apple hardware test loaded and select your language. And once you select your language, you can go ahead and now perform the test. All right, well, thank you for watching. If you have any questions, any issues, leave your comment below and please subscribe to my channel.